We're back. Hi. Hello. Hey, you won't believe this. <laughs> we just got given some red claw. Yep. Another one. Now this is a female one. She gets a bit touchy. So yeah, you know, like down, mom. <laughs> just bend down gently and give him her one too. So she's coming closer. And then we've got another one here. Whoa! Another one. There you go. They come for their biscuits in the afternoon. Just bend down. I'm going to get some more because I've got a few now. I'm going to get some more biscuits for them. Too. I got no more. Oh, one's on my bike. <laughs> Look at that! That's my bike! Is it your bike? get that one out. Katie Kate, I need you to get the final piece of the puzzle which is the back chock. Okay we are ready to go, ready to roll. We actually should really tell you about our stay here because it's been fantastic. It was four years ago Katie? I know, yeah well that that's right we set off 2019, went to Carnarvon Gorge, came here, love it. Can On you believe? the same <laughs> Sight. What are the chances of that? Yep, new owners, new managers, so just, you know, I don't know. It's our site, people. Yeah. 89, 89. or 68, depending on your perspective. <laughs> Jasper said, look, we're back on site 68. Clever little dick. Yeah. All right, uh, so he's in the car, he's ready to go, but let's just give you a good lay of the land here. We are in the naughty corner. Well, we're just near the naughty corner. Oh. I thought this was the naughty corner, but apparently the really, really naughty corner is just down there. Oh, okay. They're the ones we could hear partying. Yeah. Okay. Well, we're in the, you know, not so naughty, naughty, but nice corner. Yeah. And we love it here because you get those views out over Lake Maraboon, mm. aka Thunburn Dam. Something like that anyway. Please correct me if yeah. you know what it is. It is so it's so beautiful getting those water glimpses. We love it. Mm. And something we loved is having a fire. Now, you can use your own fire pit if it's self-contained and off the ground. Mm -hmm. Or they can drop one down with a $20 bin of wood. So good. So good. Uh, yeah. We love that. Watching the sunset here like that across the water is just stunning. We had that great cook up on the barbie. Yeah. Now Jasper and I went down to have a swim in the pool and let's just say she's a little fresh. It's cold. Hmm? Are you going to go in? Yeah, I'll go in. You first. No, 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 I'll go in if you go in. I'll go in if you go in. Oh, uh, pay, uh, pay the scissor up. Okay, you have to go in. Right -o. And it's cold. <gasps> Righto. You agreed. Hey. You agreed to this. You're the one who made the bet. Uh. 
You're coming in too. No, nah, in properly. <laughs> in fully. Okay, well I have to flush out to get a time Yeah, I'm glad you guys went, not me. A bit too chilly for me. What we love about Lake Maraboon every time we've been, and this is our third visit now over mm -hmm. the five years, is that the grounds are just really well maintained. It's laid out really great. There's heaps of sites and different areas that you can set up in if you want to be up close to the pool and the cafe, which we went up and had some dinner and the food was great. We recommend the pizza. Definitely the pizza. Unfortunately, there is no red claw pizza mm. anymore, but I think it's because the dam is at 30, two and a half percent or something uh, last time we we're here it was at 13 percent and so there is red claw galore yeah. at the moment uh, in fact we were gifted some red claw how oh, good is no, that so good we're back hi Hello. hey you won't believe this <laughs> we just got given some red claw no way. yep yeah. look at this you know joff who backed us in and die yeah look at they've given us Wow. Cryovac Red Claw. That's crazy. And oh. salt and pepper seasoning. How awesome are they? Yeah, short of actually cooking it for us. Wow. Legends. Yeah. Amazing. So did he give you any tips? Yeah, no, nah, it's, it's fine. Should be right, mate. Yeah, no, I reckon we'll know what we're doing. Righto. Awesome. Couple and it'll just keep like that in the fridge. Yeah, because it's cryovac. But I reckon we, you we get into it. keep it in there as long as you want. We won't, well, we're going up to the restaurant for dinner, so we might have yeah. to do it tomorrow. tomorrow. Yeah, awesome. Well, remember last time we were here, we created the Maraboon Burger. That's so. right. Mama! Daddy got some red claw. <laughs> Salt and pepper red claw, brioche bun, Mama. some lettuce, a little bit of a a chili uh, tomato sauce. Wonderful. Mommy, you like Marabin me. burger. Well done. We'll do it again. So good. Love Yum. It. Generous. Hey, kiddo, can you put this in the fridge, please? Thank you, guys. True legends. I oh, know, I can't wait to cook that up. That'll actually. be tonight in Rocky, yes. Now, a couple of other things to note if you're not coming with your home on wheels like we are. They do have the waterfront cabins with that beautiful view out over mm -hmm. the lake. There are different amenities blocks located around the park, a new dump point down in the naughty corner and since we were here last time and the entire park is now dog friendly. How good is that? Four-legged mm. family members, you are welcome. Yeah, yeah. Look, I, th I think if you I mean, four or five days, if you really wanted to come and just relax and have some days where you just sat out under mm. the awning and didn't do anything, doing that sound amazing. A week. a week here would be yeah. perfect. We love it, okay. And the management and the team here are absolutely welcoming. They're legends and the park is so beautifully maintained. Mm. We will be back, time to hit the road. Right. Over 300 kilometers because of those fires through the national parks, We've decided just to push on, yeah. get down to Rocky, hang out there for the next week, and then on to get your poon. To the ocean, we are, we're almost at the ocean, so yeah, just over 300 clicks, let's get going. Right. Let's do it. Seems like you've been busy since you went away. I'm just flipping through your pictures, so I can tell you look more than okay. Think I need help. As happy as you Could you tell me What I'm supposed to do without you It's like I'm just seeing empty faces Staring from across the room When all I want is to get out of here And back to you On my way home I'll stop at your window I should have known how much it hurts When you used to love somebody
behind us here is an ancient volcano. Uh, it was an active volcano about 120 million years ago and um, so we're very fortunate to be so close uh, and situated on top of a remnant section of lava from that volcano and that's Rainforest Jasper as it's called. Uh, it's just a commercial name but it's a pretty cool name. Uh, is actually rhyolite lava. Wow. So we're sitting on that lava and as you can see in that piece there it's sort of almost self-explanatory you can see how these features here are like bubbles Ooh. well they're the thunder eggs eventually they were gas bubbles that developed when that lava flowed across from the volcano it's quite a gooey type of material so it was restricting and held these bubbles in there but the bubbles weren't like this at that stage they were like this. So we have the gas bubble which was like this at the beginning. The gas is trapped in here and the movement of the gas through the lava drew the lava to create and form a skin around gas pockets and, and that's how these became what they are. But as that cooled into rock it developed cracks and those cracks allowed the gases to disappear and fortunately at a, a period of time later there's been a saturation where mineral solutions have travelled down through those cracks so the cavity then has been able to become filled with mineral as the uh, crystallisation takes place. So you can go from one like this to maybe oh, one like that where you've got the actual crystals and these are quartz minerals so we get quartz crystal, solid quartz, uh, agate and jasper. So uh, they're variations of quartz minerals that you can get in a thunder egg and it could have a combination of all that in one, you know. So they're amazing things in that they're a surprise package but can be quite amazing sometimes. So that's how it all came about. Wow. It's the 120 million years of weathering. The lava now is becoming the dirt that you're actually digging in to find the thunder eggs and uh, you can also find pieces of the lava itself as well. Not all as good as this, not always, but there are some spectacular bits found. And uh, yeah, it's just, it's just incredible what comes out of the dirt, you know, and it, it looks like nothing. A little bit better today after the rain, but uh, generally it's just dry dirt and rock until you wash them and cut them. Yeah, it's quite mm -hmm. amazing, yeah. The thunder egg, which is the bubble. See how they have that rounded sort of feature about them? Yeah. Sometimes they look like bubbles. See that one there? That, you can see it looks like... That's very bubbly. Yeah. So the secret to it is washing the dirt off the stones. Looking at those shapes, that's what sort of thing you're trying to find. Hello, right, Jasper. This is what you need to go and find your own piece of rainforest, Jasper, eh? Oh. Couple of picks. Awesome. Fantastic. Thank and you very much, Don. We need a bucket and some water for washing. Okay. Bucket and water. And then we sing hi ho. Hi ho. Hi -ho. Hi -ho. It's, it's off to work we go. go. Do you know that one? Yeah. Oh. oh. <laughs> Righty-o. Right. So out this way we head. So there's Mount Hay over there. That's a volcanic plug. That's a solid rock mass. That's the remnant volcano. We're standing on what's left of some of that rhyolite lava flow. This is how it ends up. It's breaking up into this dirt and rock. And uh, yeah, some amazing stuff out there. So mm. we just got to find it. Yeah, that's the, right, eh? yeah. the treasure hunt. That's quite neat, that one. That that's is. A one. Oh wow, that looks cool. Yeah, that's that one that's Katie found treasure. there. That's a little chip, a bit of crystal. Oh, yeah. look at this. That's a little one, like a little oh, nut, isn't it? Look at it. Hey, a little nut. Tim. T. T. What's that one? Oh no, that one's just nah, That's nothing. That it's one there looks like it. one. Yeah, a little bit of smoky amethyst by looks. Yeah, that's cool. 
Wow, look at the size of that, Jasper. Oh, that's awesome. Just totally rinsed by the rain, eh? That's amazing. Wow. See, look here, you can see the round look lump here. Hiding in your pockets, There's man. a beauty, look at that. Oh, you yeah, that. It's one. actually coupled together. Oh, yeah, they're the bits, yeah. See that one? <laughs> cut him along there. Wow. Here's a Jasper one, so we'll imagine we've got to cut that, haven't we? <laughs> we'll try these. Beautiful. Yeah, sure. Well, Can I come around? Come okay. With this saw, it's a diamond saw running in oil. Mm -hmm. So we cut in oil to um, give us a better cut because of the friction involved. Okay. Yeah, so, uh, because of the diameter of the blade. Like small blades, they cut in water, but this size, you need to use oil. Mm -hmm. Too many TV programs. Yeah. <laughs> so little, this little one at the beginning, the first one. Oh. See the crystal? There's a crystal pocket in there. See how? Yeah. It's, it? it's oh, quite neat, that. that. That's really amazing. Such a small thing, so beautiful. So beautiful. I think so beautiful. Yeah, yeah incredible. Well, you couldn't dream these things up if you tried, you know. Oh, and this one's got pretty. spotted jasper in the corner <laughs> with agate. Spotted. <laughs> you know, you're popping up a few times here today, mate. <laughs> yeah. Oh, wow. And then this one here, it's two eggs together. Oh, yeah. what? That's amazing. That's incredible. They come with you. That is beautiful. Agate, little agate down there, yeah. Wow. That is cool. That is beautiful. So thoroughly wash these when you do the dishes tonight, okay? All right. After you finish the dishes, throw these in the dish water. Okay. Give them a wash and get them clean and dry them off. So then you can put a bit of spray them with a bit of clear varnish. Okay. All right. Excellent. That might be a, a good school project. You might even stop by a Bunnings. Yeah. Bunnings Warehouse. Okay, great. Thanks for watching. Please do like, subscribe, and share our channel. And if you'd like more information on full time RV travel and living, visit our website, thefeelgoodfamily.com. There you'll find loads of free resources, our weekly podcast, caravan cooking recipes, and much more. We look forward to seeing you next week. Take care of yourself and your family, and happy trails.